good morning children uh, today i have brought uh, four special points regarding a triangle uh, so far as the school students school going students are concerned i mean classes 8 9 10th even up to 11th and 12th too what i have realized during the past few years of my teaching experience Uh, that uh, many of the students are always seen to be confused uh, with these points and uh, that is why i thought it to be necessary to make a video uh, regarding these points so let me start one by one the very first point i have taken here is circum center in a triangle the circum center you must have heard many times circum center of a triangle as the name suggests is the center of a circle which circumscribes the triangle circum center is the center of a circle circumscribing a triangle that is center of circum circle but at the same time it is defined as the point of intersection of perpendicular bisectors of its three sides once again the circum center of a triangle is the point of intersection point of intersection of perpendicular bisectors of the three sides of a triangle and normally it is denoted by the letter c second centroid centroid of a triangle this is very much popular centroid centroid is very much popular uh, it is the point of intersection of the three medians in a triangle it is the point of intersection of the three medians of a triangle and what is median median is a line actually there are three medians i have said each of the medians is defined as the line joining any of the vertices to the middle point of the opposite side median of a triangle is the line joining any of the vertices i mean the median of a triangle is a line which joins a vertex to the middle point of the opposite side okay and the point of intersection of all such medians is called centroid it is normally denoted by the letter capital g now come to the in center in center as the name suggests it is the center of the in circle of a triangle but at the same time it is also defined as the point of intersection of the angle bisectors of a triangle angle bisectors of a triangle if uh, we uh, find out the point of intersection of any two angle bisectors then the third angle bisector the third angle bisector must pass through the same point and the point of intersection of these angular bisectors is called the in center of a triangle okay now come to the ortho center after uh, defining all these centers i will be explaining the mutual link of these uh, points ortho center is the point of intersection of all the three altitudes of a triangle what is an altitude means an altitude is a perpendicular drawn from a vertex to the opposite side remember it is not the perpendicular bisector i am not talking the perpendicular bisector perpendicular bisector plays its role here but here so far the ortho center is concerned ortho center is the point of intersection of all the three altitudes and an altitude of a triangle is a line drawn from a vertex to the opposite side such that it is perpendicular to the opposite side so 
all the three perpendiculars simply we are drawing perpendiculars from a vertex to the opposite side and all the three such perpendiculars are concurrent and the point of concurrence is called ortho center now children look there is some relation also in a triangle in a triangle this ortho center centroid and circumcenter three points are always collinear in a triangle ortho center the circums uh, the centroid g and the circumcenter c ortho center the centroid and the circumcenter this is very important children you may not find this fact in many of the books in general so um, remember it keep it in your mind that these three points in a triangle is is you know collinear these three points are collinear all these three points are always lying on a line a straight line what are those three points see i am not talking about the in center here only the ortho center the centroid and the circum center here you must know that a centroid of a triangle divides any of the medians into the ratio 2 is to 1 the two part is towards the vertex and the one part is towards the side so students uh, every median or each of the medians is divided by the centroid in the ratio 2 is to 1 two parts is towards the vertex and the one part towards the side and similarly the same centroid divides the line joining ortho center and circum center also in the ratio 2 is to 1 this is very very beautiful you know concept very beautiful concept you must remember you must keep in, in in your mind that a centroid of a triangle divides the line joining the ortho center and the circum center in the ratio 2 is to 1 and ortho center centroid once again i am telling you ortho center the centroid and the circum center all these three points are collinear all these three points are collinear 